The scenario here is that we have a non-directed donor who's come forth to donate. What we mean by a non-directed donor is a an altruistic um, soul, if you will, who comes forward and wants to donate a kidney, not necessarily to a recipient of their choice, but to society at large. And this person is um, donating a kidney here today. I just got done with the donor operation, and it's being uh, shipped to Fargo, North Dakota, where there's a suitable recipient for this donor. And therefore, we are starting this paired donation chain, if you will, and we hope to be able to continue this along. And I'll explain to you how. Here's a non-directed donor with a blood type O, who donates to a recipient who's a blood type O. That recipient had a donor who could not have donated to them. That's a blood type A. However, that donor now can donate to another recipient who's the same blood type. And in turn, that recipient has a donor that's a blood type B who cannot donate to this recipient. Instead, they donate on in the chain to another recipient with a blood type B, and so on and so forth. So this chain could go on forever. It's really a paid forward system. So if you receive a, a kidney from this chain and then your donor who could not donate to you then donates on to somebody else who had a similar situation and then so on and so forth. Um, so it, it just, you pay back in a sense what you received from the system and therefore keeping that chain going in perpetuity. This is somewhat new, the whole concept of this uh, uh, domino effect and we hope to uh, continue working on it. It's still in its uh, infancy. There are several centers around the country doing it and we hope to uh, formalize it and have it uh, developed further.